Breast Care International observes such intervention gives respite especially to needy patients who are unable to afford infusions. President Dr. Beatrice Riafia Dai acknowledges continued support from direct relief to Ghanaians over the last decade. So we've been receiving items from uh, direct relief who are partners in the U.S. Um, this particular consignment came in a 40-footer container and it contained, uh, contains uh, infusions namely ringus lactate, uh, dextrose saline, 5% dextrose, water for injection and also oral rehydration salts. Um, most often when people go to the hospital in critical conditions we look for infusions and sometimes they are asked to go and buy the infusions and so I'm sure this is going to fill in the gap that the infusions will be readily available and no patient will be asked to go and buy before they get their supply of the infusions that they need. The ORS is also a special type of ORS because it contains more of the electrolytes and I'm sure it's going to help both children and adults. We want the beneficiary institutions to send them uh, to their facilities uh, give them to the patients who are needy and not ask them for money. We didn't uh, pay for them. They are also, we are also not selling to them and they are also not supposed to sell. That is the condition we have on the uh, consignment. They are meant strictly for donations. I thank you. Beneficiary institutions share gratitude to Breast Care International and its partners for the gesture. We thank Peace and Love and direct, uh, direct Relief for these special drugs. It's going to help us very much because we have been receiving more things from them and it's helping our village very well. We've been a beneficiary from this program since the beginning. It has helped us a lot because in Kwabri Municipal we have a lot of cheap compounds and hospitals around and we have a very poor community too. And these drugs are very expensive. So after, when we get this medicine, when we dispatch to them, it gives a lot of help to them and they are always happy about it and they always give thanks to them and them. So what we hope and pray that when we deliver to the hospitals, they should also give it out free as we give the instructions that go on. Reporting for Joy News, Kwesi Debra.